Hi, my name is Liz Crawford and I'm with the Houston Area Parkinson Society and we're going to do some hand exercises today. We're going to start by just as if you're giving a person a handshake, we're just going to nice firm grasp and switch and switch nice and firm like you're giving a good handshake. Good. Now we're going to interlace the fingers. So this is working the muscles inside the fingers. We're going to squeeze and then we're going to switch so the other fingers are on top. Squeeze. 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 Two more. Good. Now we're going to put the hands together, praying hands. <laughs> and we're going to just cross the thumbs and switch. Keep breathing. <laughs> we tend to forget to breathe when we're concentrating. Now these two fingers cross. It's like the fingers are dancing. These two fingers cross. The ring fingers cross. And the pinkies. Pinkies don't like to work. We do need them, especially if you use a computer. Good. Now we're going to put the tips of the fingers together. So we're bringing them here and then pushing them apart. So pushing the hands towards each other in and out, in and out. And stretch those fingers. Good. All right, so now we're going to touch the forefinger to the thumb. So you've got a circle shape and then you flatten it to make a teardrop shape. So a little push ups with the fingers. Middle finger to the thumb, circle and flatten to that teardrop shape, little push ups. Ring finger to the thumb. And the pinky. So just shake the hands now, they get tired. We're not used to working so hard. <laughs> Good. All right. So now we're going to touch the forefinger to the thumb on the opposite hand and bring the other forefinger to the thumb and we're going to switch. Keep breathing. Have to concentrate a little harder on these. The thumb's going to have to be stretching a little bit further, so the middle finger and the thumb, middle finger and the thumb, 
opposite hand and switch. Now the ring finger, thumb to the ring finger on the opposite hand, thumb to the finger here and switch. If you don't get it completely right, don't worry, just move those fingers. And last but not least, the pinky. So thumb to the pinky on one side, thumb to the pinky on the other, and switch. Now you can always do it down lower if your arms are getting tired. <laughs> I'm just doing it up here to show you. I think this is eight. Good. All right, so take the thumb all the way over to the base of the pinky and back out, across, stretch that across, circle the thumb. and back the other way. It's quite a joint here, just 360 degrees. All right, so now we've got um, touching the thumb to each finger and we're gonna number them. One, two, three, four, and this is five. Again, one, two, three, four, and five, then we go backwards. Five, four, three, two, one. Five, four, three, two, one. Just relax a minute. Deep breath. <laughs> now we're gonna jump around a little bit This, uh, so we have to pay attention. I'm gonna call out a number and sometimes I make a mistake too, so don't worry. So we'll start with five, one, four, two, three, five, two, four, one, three. Good. Relax a minute. Breathe. <laughs> it's good. We have to pay attention here. I do too. So here we go again. One, five, two, five, four, one, three, two, five, four, one, five. All right, relax, breathe. <laughs> Let's do one more time. Two, four, one, three, five, two, four, one, five, three, two, one, five. Excellent. Very good. So now we're going to take the tips of the fingers here, tips of finger of the other hand, and we're just going to, like a little tug of war with yourselves, I'm just going to pull, relax, pull, try not to pull your hands apart, pull, 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 and one more, pull, relax. Then the other fingers on top, just the fingertips here. We're gonna try and pull the fingers, tug of war here, relax, pull, relax, pull, relax. Four more. Keep breathing. Very good. So shake out, shake them out. That's probably plenty of exercise to do um, with your hands at any one time. But what we're gonna do now is just take a little lotion in the hands. That's a bit too much, but never mind. Um, and just uh, gently rub the lotion in. This is also good. You've got 
wrist movement and hand movement going on. <laughs> Little treat at the end of the class. Get a nice smelling hand lotion. Then you can just um, gently massage the palm of the hand here at the base. You can work the fingers and stretch them out. Each finger in turn, middle finger. And the other hand, start with the pinky, kind of stretch them, pull, pull the joints. <laughs> And if it's still not nice and rubbed in, you can keep going. <laughs> All right, very good. Thank you so much for joining me and I uh, hope you enjoy these exercises. Take care, bye-bye.